There's a lot of excitement here in Ave. Our young program, we're constantly improving. We're going to end up with guys here who really want to make a difference. Guys who know that the program that they leave four years from now is going to be that much better than the program they joined today. You really got to grow up. Just going to college in itself and then being a student athlete, um, there's a lot that encompasses that name. Our coaches emphasize is holding each other accountable. We have a phrase, be your brother's keeper. I think we got a lot of heart and I think we've become tough. And going through adversity, that forces you to become closer to your brother. Uh, our guys have really bought into the uh, belief of being their brother's keeper. Uh, they're pushing each other every single day, uh, whether it's on the field, in the weight room, in the classroom. Uh, they're really looking out for each other and uh, making sure we're putting ourselves in the best position to be uh, a great football team. When it, when it comes down to brotherhood, um, when I was a student and a player here, um, that family that I made outside of my original family is something that's, that's so significant. Um, we still talk to each other three years out of college, you know, almost on a day-to-day -day basis. These are like the brothers that I've grown to love and like I, I went through the struggle with them, the pain of like the early morning workouts and just having them with me and I can count on them on and off the field. You have to be honest with yourself and what you want for your future. I want to wake up every day excited to go to work. I don't want to be in a nine to five job that I'm not uh, satisfied with. I want to receive my degree in exercise science. At Ave is especially nice. I got a good relationship with Coach Patterson, that's the head coach. I feel like we get along really well and can communicate back and forth. Here at Ave Maria University, it's a life-changing decision for a young man, I feel. You're encouraged to make you know, new friends, people that you, you've never met before in, in, in brand new places from all over the world, all over the country. Located in sunny Southwest Florida, Ave Maria University resides in the town of Ave Maria, a planned development of its founder, Tom Monahan. The school has 1,100 students from 45 states and 24 countries. The academic curriculum has more than 30 academic majors and the average class size is 20 students. The student to faculty ratio is 14 to one. And nearly 90% of the faculty have the highest degree in their field. The atmosphere is always crazy during game time and everybody just loves you, everybody in town loves you and Saturday nights, it's a, it's a big party and uh, we love to have fun down here with these football games. Our schedule is uh, very, very diverse in terms of where we can travel to. Our schools in the Mid-South Conference are anywhere from Ohio to Alabama to Virginia to Kentucky to Tennessee uh, to North Carolina to Georgia. Last couple seasons and this coming season we have the opportunity to play a Division I opponent. After about 40 years, give or take a little bit of coaching ball at all different levels, there's certain common denominators that championship teams have. And three of the ones that we stress pretty much all the time and have for many, many years are being physical, being disciplined, and playing with passion. So when we leave the field and other people say, hey, I was that Ave Maria team, no matter what anything else they say, they should say that was a physical team. They were relentless. We want to win everything that we can win. We want to win by getting to class on time, by being a good son, we want to win by being a good teammate. We want to win in the weight room. We want to win in the locker room. We want to win on the field. Things that I like most about our players is, is, is their excitement in everything that we do. We want players who are passionate, players who love the game of football. We're looking for athletes that are, that are hungry, disciplined, uh, willing to work. They try to be the best that they can be every day. They represent our school with uh, the passion and the love that we try to give to them. You know, we like to bring pressure. We like to move guys around. We do all the formations. We'll put two tight ends and three tight ends out there. We'll put in four receivers out there a lot. Tate looking. Tate will throw the screen pass to O'Connor. O'Connor makes the first man miss. He is loose to the 20. Kevon O'Connor, touchdown Jiree. Well, I think when you look at practice, I think you look at challenging yourselves to get as good as you can get. And I think that comes from competing. And the best way to do that in football other than on Saturday afternoons is to do it on the practice field and uh, we challenge our guys in every drill and every rep and we want them to get as good as they can get whether we're going offense versus defense or we're just doing individual drills uh, within the position group and I think that if you do that you have a chance to get as good as you can get and that's what we try to do in, in everyday life here at Ave, whether it's in the classroom, the weight room or on the practice field we're going to try to push our guys to get as good as they can get. That's the goal right? Every time you step on the field you get better or you don't 
And so our goal is to get better every day at something. I'm thrilled with the coaching staff that's here at Ave Maria. We've got some gentlemen with tremendous experience at Notre Dame, Bowling Green, Youngstown State, University of North Carolina, University of Wisconsin. They come from Colorado State, University of Virginia, Illinois. They've all come together here at Ave to give Ave Maria football a chance to be something special. It's truly exciting to see all of this experience come together for a single purpose.